Thames with more personal mudslinging today. But the Prime Minister has refused to comment on the latest attack, instead selling himself as clean and green. Visiting Australia's only commercial solar cell factory, the Prime Minister was anxious not to put a foot wrong. I won't pack anything up, will I? <laughs> well, um... Yes, yes, I will. So I'll stand back there. He won't sign up to Kyoto, but he's announced a target for clean, green energy. 30,000 gigawatt hours of low emissions energy generation by 2020. That's about 15%. It's going to throw in so-called clean coal and potentially nuclear as part of the mix. What a farce. This is a very substantial commitment to clean energy sources. Not substantial enough for the world's biggest climate change campaigner. There is a clear and stark difference in the positions of the two candidates. One supports ratification of the World Treaty to solve the climate crisis, and the other opposes it. 